Hello and welcome. Today we're talking about drugs and their impact on health. So drugs and health. This is for key stage three biology. The first thing to probably do is to define what we mean by drugs. And these are chemicals that affect the way the body works. Chemicals that affect the body or the way the body works. We can split these up into two main types of drug or two main types of drugs that are used. We have what we call medicinal drugs, medicinal drugs shown on the left there, and recreational drugs shown on the right. So we've got medicinal drugs that are used to treat illness and recreational drugs as well. In terms of our medicinal drugs, these have a whole bunch of different uses, but one example might be for illness or treating the symptoms of illness. And the type of drug we might talk about is something like paracetamol. There are, of course, lots of others, but paracetamol is one. And this is uh, used for something like pain relief or fever and stuff like that. We also have antibiotics. Antibiotics are chemicals that are used to kill, for example, bacteria. In fact, not for example, they are used to kill bacteria that cause disease chest infection, throat infection, that kind of stuff. It might be useful to introduce a key term here. Bacteria that cause disease are often referred to as pathogens. Pathogens. It's not just bacteria. It could be other microorganisms as well, but bacteria that cause disease are called pathogens. In terms of our recreational drugs, we've got legal ones and we've got illegal ones as well. In terms of our legal recreational drugs, one of the common ones is alcohol, found in lots of different types of drinks. And alcohol is a type of drug that's not only legal, but it's, dis uh, it's described as a depressant, a depressant. And this is a drug that slows down or slows the nervous system. So alcohol is a depressant. One of the other issues with alcohol is that it is addictive. It's legal, but it's also addictive. If we use alcohol, if alcohol is used over a long period of time in excessive amounts, it can damage various parts of the body. It can damage the liver. It can damage the brain and the heart. If it's used over a period of time in excessive amounts. We also have, as well as alcohol, we have tobacco. Now, now tobacco itself is not a drug. It's the chemicals in the tobacco. So one of the key ones is nicotine. And nicotine is the chemical that's actually addictive that's found in tobacco. We also have something called tar and other chemicals. These have negative effects on the body. And one of the common ones that we often think about, for example, tar can cause cancer. It can lead to cancer. And a common type of cancer is lung cancer that's caused by tar. But it can lead to other kinds of cancers as well, given that there are so many chemicals that are found in tobacco. In terms of our illegal drugs, we have a couple of examples here. One is called cocaine and one is heroin. These are quite severe drugs. They are very addictive. That means you don't have to take much at all before you find you're addicted to them. And not only are they addictive, but they can also lead to quite serious health issues serious health issues but not only uh, health issues we can talk about the idea that they lead to social issues as well for example a lot of money uh, could be spent on those and where does that money come from and effects on other parts of life as well these are social issues caused by these drugs the word addictive is probably quite important to make sure we understand what that means so let's just make a little note of that if a person is addicted to something, 
a chemical or a drug, that means they need the drug to feel normal. They need to, the drug to feel normal. In other words, to stop feeling unwell. And what happens is that the person will suffer withdrawal symptoms. Withdrawal symptoms. And these can be things like headache, nausea, depression, uh, or a whole range of different um, feelings if they don't get the drug. And therefore, the drug is described as addictive. Okay, so that's it. A rundown of drugs, recreational and medicinal, and their effects on the body.